back to my channel so today I'm going to be doing my winged eyeliner tutorial which I said a while ago in my glam like everyday look that I would be doing and then it just kind of went by the wayside but so now I'm doing it and I'm really excited because there's gonna be three different ways of doing winged eyeliner that is not just free handing it because that took me forever to learn so if you're kind of in between learning how to do eyeliner and having absolutely no idea what you're doing this is going to be a good video for you because this is what helped me and i'm still learning so obviously this is going to work for you um so i'm really excited to upload this and i hope you guys really enjoy it so obviously all i have on right now is my regular makeup um eyeshadow and everything and then like a thin line of eyeliner across my eyelid but i do not have a wing on yet so that's what i'm going to be showing you guys um <clears throat> so the two things you're going to need are like a credit card or something with like a hard straight edge i'm just using this little like rewards card from victoria's secret because it was the closest thing i had laying around but anything that's like kind of harder and um it has a straight edge and then you're also going to need tape so really any kind of like scotch tape um is going to work so this is what i'm using so i'm using this stila stay all day waterproof liquid eyeliner in this tutorial you don't have to use liquid eyeliner, but I'm not gonna promise you the results are gonna be the same because that is what I'm using to show you how to do this. So any kind of liquid eyeliner, honestly, like drugstore, name brand, like whatever, like probably all works the same. So this is the one that I'm using because this is the one I already have and I really like it. So I'm just gonna show you three different ways to do a winged liner that is going to be a lot easier than just freehanding it like I'm doing now or that I've been doing since I figured out how to do it. But these are ways that you can do until you get used to creating that wing like by yourself without these hacks. So I hope you guys really enjoy this and I hope this comes out. I'm right. gonna show you is with tape because that's actually how I learned how to do winged liner like first. So you take a little piece of tape and you line it up diagonal from the corner of your eye where you want your eyeliner to start to the corner of your eyebrow. It doesn't feel great. No, I know that. And also you might wanna do this before you do the rest of your makeup because the tape will pull off a little bit of it but you can also just redo it so if you see ben in the background he's kind of exploring come here ben um <clears throat> so this is going to create a really good base for your wing and also if you mess it up like on this side it's just going to get on the tape so you pull the tape off and it's fine which i really liked about that and you can also do your eyeshadow with this on and it'll create a really good like line with your shadows too so i'm just going to be using this little palette to look into so if i'm not looking at the viewfinder or the camera that's why but you'll still be able to see what I'm doing, so. Okay, so I'm taking my eyeliner and I'm literally just like figuring out where I want this to be. So I want mine to go about this far and I'm just marking right on that tape. Can you see that? And then kind of pulling it over to the rest of the eyeliner. But see, like, you can literally get it all over there like that. Like, that looks ridiculous, right? But then, when you pull off this tape, you have a perfect wing. So, you may want to touch it up a little bit. Like, I didn't bring mine in far enough in here. But now you have a wing. Which worked quite well. And it was a whole lot easier than trying to sit there and, like, freehand that. So that is the first way that I'm gonna show you guys how to hack your winged eyeliner. So the second way I'm gonna show you guys how to do this, and it's really similar actually, the tape just is easier because you don't have to hold it. But so I have this little card and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold it up here like this, basically exactly what I did with the tape, except for I have to hold it. And then you're gonna do the same thing. I don't have my little mirror, so. Just gonna create a little wing. And I have to do the rest of mine in the mirror because I can't see that. But that, see, that just created like a little bitty line and that can kind of like guide you on where you want to put your liner. Oh, sorry, that was not helpful at all. You couldn't see anything, but so I'm just filling this in. And there's your second wing. So you just use that piece of cardboard or credit card or whatever to kind of give you like an idea of where this is gonna go and use it to make your line <clears throat> and then you just fill it in. So it's a whole lot easier and it's a really straight line and you can line it up to your eyebrow again because that's kind of where I like mine to go. And I've heard a lot of people say that too that it's supposed to line up with the edge of your brow line. Um, I think that looks the best, but it's obviously up to you. You can do this, I mean, 
any which way. So that works for pretty much any way you want to do your eyeliner and you can obviously bring your wing like farther out. I don't because I like more of a natural look so that's the reason why mine is so short. But if you want to have like a really big dramatic wing this obviously also works the same. This is just helping you to get that straight line and then you just fill it in with the liner. And then I'm going to show you the last way which is kind of the harder way but when you're getting used to like making a wing without this stuff, this will be the way you want to use like intermediate. Okay, so I just took the wing off of this eye. So my eye looks a little wonky, but so this is the last way that I'm going to teach you guys how to do liner if you're not good at it. So this obviously, this liquid eyeliner and most liquid eyeliners, I don't know if you can see that. Can you see that at all? Has like a really straight tip to it. So you can even use this to guide you. This is gonna be a little bit harder because it's easier to mess up, but it's really not that bad once you get used to it. So what you're gonna do, I'm gonna hold this so you guys can actually see, is use this as your like liner marker. So line it up with your brow again, and then just tap it like that. So obviously that looks a little ridiculous. You're gonna have to fix any of the stuff that you do kind of a little bit. So you just fill it in. So obviously that one was a little bit bigger of a wing just because it is a bigger tip so it's going to create a bigger wing. So there you go. There's your wing. So this one's a little bigger, this one's a little more natural so it just kind of depends on what you want your wing to look like and how experienced you are and how well this goes for you because for me it depends on the morning. So. That is how I do my eyeliner. Obviously I won't leave it like this because they look very different. Um, but I just thought that'd be a really cool video to make because I always had a really hard time doing winged eyeliner and these really helped me until you get used to doing it without this stuff. So I really hope you guys enjoyed that video and I hope those tricks help you. I know they really helped me and were a great way for me to get you know, acquainted with doing winged eyeliner and using liquid eyeliner and it was a lot less frustrating than just doing it and redoing it and wiping it off a thousand times. So I hope you guys really liked that. If you want to see any other kinds of videos that are like tutorials, not that I feel exactly qualified to be giving that advice, but if you want it, I'll do it. Um, let me know down in the comments or if there's anything else you want to see. I've been doing a lot of polls on my Instagram on what people want to see, so I'm trying to cater the content to that but I'm just kind of throwing stuff out there. So if there's anything specific you want to see, please leave it in the comments. And I would love to do a video um, on anything pretty much. So let me know what you want to see. Ben, it just came in. Um, and thank you so much for watching. Please like and give this a thumbs up and also comment and subscribe if you haven't already. I put out new videos, not on a schedule whatsoever, but they just come at you randomly. And sometimes you get five and sometimes you get one. So please subscribe. I'm really excited for you guys to see this and I'm really excited for you guys to be a part of my channel. Thanks so much.